This is the unboxing of the Tekken 8 Premium Collector's Edition. Alright guys, so I didn't actually expect it to arrive that early because I was just sleeping. It is uh, just uh, about 9 a.m. in the morning. Suddenly I wake up to the bell on because the bell is ringing on the door and uh, I, I think I never kick started out of my bed that fast. So yeah, ran, ran down and uh, here we are. Here we got it. So let's open it. Okay, so here we got the case of the game, Tekken 8 Ultimate Edition with the golden with the golden cover art. So this is where they put the stickers. Okay, some Namco store QR code and uh, stuff. Then we have download code. Okay, so this is uh, where the Steam code is inside. Then we have the stickers, well, the Mishima Zaibatsu sticker, you can see it because it's black. Uh, the G Corp, uh, you probably not see it. Let's, let's, ah, nah, there you go. The metal plate. So this is a Tekken 8 metal plate. You can... Uh, you can uh, screw it to your, to your wall if you want or something like that, yeah. I think it looks quite good, it looks sharp. Image quality good. And now here is the Tekken 8 Steelbook. So the Tekken 8 Steelbook has uh, the, the iconic uh, new cover art. It's uh, Jin on one side and Kazuya on the other side, obviously. And if you open it, this is where you could put discs in if you have one, but uh, nowadays it's all digital. And uh, this is how the full cover art looks like. Very, very beautiful uh, steel box, if you ask me. I really like this. I like steel boxes. Much better than uh, the normal paper boxes. The thing is, I'm an old guy, so maybe you remember the old video game, um, uh, the, the old vi video game boxes. Like, for example, N64, and uh, Super Nintendo, uh, PlayStation. PlayStation, it started already with the, with the CDs. So it was much smaller, but... There was a time um, where uh, where video games came with with massive boxes and also with nice manuals, with colorful manuals, and uh, you also you always had something to read. And uh, if it was a good video game box, you almost had a whole book in there. And every time I was buying a video game, when I was on my way home in the in the in the train or in the bus, what I did then is that was when I opened it and and read the manual while I'm on way home, just to, to hype me up even more. Uh, sadly, this is not the case anymore today because stuff is always uh, almost always digital. But uh, this is also the reason why I like to get uh, collector's, boxing, uh, collector's boxes because they still have this physical quality of, uh, of value with it instead of just a digital code. Okay, those are the cards. I have no idea. I have no idea what these cards are good for, but uh, well, I guess you just have some some collectors' cards. So here we have them with the with the eight chain. So makes sense. It's Tekken eight, and it's eight cards. Jin Kazama. And the information on the cards is it's uh, it's the character render, the name, the the country location, and um, fighting style, rage, art, heat, smash, and alias. Then we have Kazuya Mishima, Jun Kazama, Lars Alexanderson, Nina Williams. Ling Shayu, uh, Claudio Serafino, and Asuka, uh, Asuka Kazama. Uh, actually, if you ask me, they, 
I'm missing someone. I'm missing my boy King here. So yeah, uh, I, I would have been fine if they would just swapped out Claudio with uh, with King. But well, it is what it is. And uh, now here we here it comes. This looks like the big boy, dude. So this is the big gin figurine. Damn, son. Jin, you're looking good. So the quality of this figurine is really, really detailed. Gotta, gotta say that. The pants actually has like, a, has like structure. And the belt. The belt is... Uh, it's not it's not stiff so it can't break so you can take a closer look like this probably so here's the massive wing and then you have to plug it in into USB and then the wing actually glows so this is the figure with the wing um, I'm going to plug it in soon. Just want to take the rest out of the box first. So I guess this is where the where the ring is. Uh, yeah, so this is uh, a Leroy Smith ring. Uh, one of my favorite newcomers to, to the game. I think Leroy Smith is cool as hell. It fits my little finger. Maybe with some soap, I could use it on the ring finger, but, uh, well, that could end badly, but, yeah. So, it fits on my small finger. And last but not least, the arcade token. So, this is a little token. And it has a nice, it has a very nice surface. It's, it's not flat. It has the Tekken 8 logo. It has Kazuya and Jin clashing. And, um... Yeah, there you can see it. And on the other side, you see the, the Tekken trophy, and it says Arcade. Okay, so let's see. Okay, let's see if I can plug in the Jin figurine. Okay, so this is the Jin figurine plugged in. As you can see, the wing is glowing, and the 8 at the bottom as well. So, yeah, this looks pretty sick. It might be a little bit too bright now, because of the, of the lighting here and the camera so I just shut down the lights and uh, you can see the wing is pretty bright so yeah well done on this one Namco this bad boy glows pretty good okay so the only downside to this is you have you need to have it on a cable right so there's no there's no battery in it but if you have a nice spot for it with with a cable where you can put it then that's totally fine because Let's be real, it is, I mean, batteries cost money, so, yeah. This one here, you don't need to recharge batteries or buy new batteries for it. It's just, just plug it into your PC and put it next to your monitor and you have an amazing figure for yourself. Okay, this concludes this unboxing video. Thanks for watching, thanks for being here. I am really, really hyped. The first thing I'm going to do now is I'm going to put in the download code into Steam and so while it downloads I'm going to uh, wrap up this video here so I'm going to see you soon in the arena in the Tekken launch and this is going to be a hell of a time we're gonna have so yeah if you like what you see please follow subscribe like you know how it works on YouTube it's free and it helps me a lot thanks a lot for your support and see you next time peace